go. Samuels 73 Mach 1. So we got some stuff going on with her in the next two days, three days, and uh, introducing Samuels 73 Mach 1. Samuels, 1973 Mach 1. Here we go, guys. We take the frustration out So Samuel has entrusted us to work on the dash lights. We're changing out the dash pad. What else are we doing, Bobby? Driver's side blinker. Yeah, anything else? That's it. That's it for now? Keep going back. Little marks on it are here. Keep coming back. I love this body style. Can you tell, guys? All right, it's good. Move forward. So we're bringing her into the shade. Get her out of the sun. This is the overall body look and feel. Minor chips right here. I do all this stuff, guys, so everybody knows what was on the car before. Scratch here, a little bit of body work. Next, the paint's okay. I mean, it's not in the heart. Well, it's got some marks on her. All right, bring her forward again, Bobby. She's got cracking going along her bumper. A little body work, it's a little bit questionable in here. But, you know, 15 footer, you know, for, for a view. Cut her hard uh, left, Bobby. Hard left. Yeah. And there she goes, getting pulled in, looking very mean in her black and silver. This obviously is not a, uh, all right, straight back. This obviously is not a, uh, a stock paint job because it wouldn't have gone all the way to the hood like that. It would have came across. This is kind of very different. And uh, there she is. Getting ready to get work done. All the parts were picked up on um, uh, late Saturday night. Uh, and Carlos and I went out and uh, we were over there at 10 o'clock at night picking up a motor for Peter's 65 and a bunch of parts for. Uh, oh, I keep saying Peter. I said the other one too. Tony 65, uh, Robert Marshall's uh, 69. Uh, we got parts for Jack's car. He's going with the front GT kit. And this is a new pony uh, that we've been talking to for a while. And he's brought it in for his first project at Mustang Medic. So that's what she looks like as she comes he in. brought it into the stable. Yeah, we're calling it the stable. Props to that viewer that suggested calling it the stable. I like that. I've been looking for about two years trying to figure out what to call this place because I don't want to call it the corral or anything like that. So that's the condition of the paint of the, of the car. Corral's where you put not some nice horses. Pretty horses go in the stable. Have you ever spent time in a corral before, Bobby? Never mind. Don't answer that question. That You're funny. married now. All right. So uh, the I'm trim, the, the trim's missing on the front of the uh, of the grill, but I think the grill is in good shape. Yeah, the grill's intact. So she's got she's got not knockouts on the scoops. And uh, she's a beauty. I love this body style. I love all these cars, guys. I just do. It's my thing. And they're growing in popularity, which is, it makes it even cooler. So, missing the antenna. There's some bad prep work on there. And there's some custom paint. Somebody, uh, somebody loved this car and personalized it. So, here we go. Day one of Samuels, 1973, Mach 1. Coming. Straight back, straight back. We gotta, we gotta, we gotta be straight. We'll go. Are we getting it in all the way? Right there, well. So we gotta be able to be we gotta, right there. Well, we have stuff in the way. I know it's hard to explain. It's in the details, guys. My back corner? Yeah. <laughs>